The main goals of Earth Life is to make sure that we as a country uh, shift towards a just transition towards sustainable energy. Earth Life seeks to prevent uh, environmental decay and, social, and promote social justice. So um, we're looking at a win-win for both the environment and people. We have to take the starting point that people are part of the environment and then any environmental problem there's an underlying social problem that needs to be resolved in order to solve that environmental problem. We definitely are recognised by governments, but we do not get support from them because most of the time we are at odds with what they do. We are hoping that Anglo-American will stop building coal fire power stations in South Africa and start building renewable energy technologies. There's simply no carbon space left in South Africa's own carbon budget or the world's carbon budget to add new coal fire power stations. If I'm able to educate 15 people and out of those 15, two of them can be able to take what they have learned and take it out there. We're also looking at sustainability of jobs, getting into the communities, empowering communities, so that they can start doing things for themselves. We haven't really got the funding to do other advertising. That's our biggest challenge. Oh, we can donate. Um, <laughs> cash is always welcome. But more than that is your participation. So come to events like this. We need everybody in Johannesburg and South Africa to get engaged on this, because everybody will suffer if we have runaway climate change, and that's what we're looking at. I think if we had money, you know, we would want people to know, as many people as, as you know, irrespective of where they're coming from, we, we, we would like um, to have more of, of our advertising to be, you know, to reach out to as many people, but now the issue is about resources. Uh, Anglo is following an old business model. It's the business model of the 20th and 19th century, where you dig dirty coal out of the ground, you burn it cheaply, and you produce electricity. Those days are gone. We say that we have plenty of sunshine in South Africa, and not only in South Africa, but in Africa as a whole. Solar is becoming very economic as an alternative, whereas coal power is going up in price. Basically, solar, clean energy, wind energy uh, are much preferable. Anybody can get involved as an individual or as a family, not, but not as a business. We have a Facebook page um, and you can also call our office 011-339-3662 and come and join us. We have lots of meetings, we have lots of events going on. We also encourage people to come and be at meet our meetings and stand up for places on the executive because we are short of young people. <laughs>